mysterious cosmic rays shooting out of Antarctica could shatter the standard physics model. There's something strange happening beneath the surface of Antarctica. Neam Harris, your Newswire reports, physicists are baffled by strange cosmic rays that are shooting out of a frozen ground in Antarctica. NASA-affiliated researchers set out to observe cosmic rays showered down on Earth from above just over a decade ago. Let me read that again. NASA-affiliated research set out to observe, they were looking at observing the cosmic rays showering towards Earth from above about 10 years ago. During their experiments, they found something they could not explain. Something that may well change everything we thought we knew about physics. Researchers believe that the experiment may have found the first evidence of a new type of particle that has evaded detection by some of the most sophisticated particle accelerators for years. The super symmetrical particle that physicists have been seeking since the launch of the Large Hadron Collider. The Mind Unleashed reports the Antarctic Impulsive Transient Antenna, ANITA for short, balloon experiment began in 2006 when the balloon spent a month hovering over Antarctic Earth, Antarctica's ice. Using sensors, ANITA began detecting high energy neutrinos interacting with the ice below. The ice sheet below. Neutrinos are unique in that they do not lose energy as they disseminate throughout the universe. And because of this, neutrinos are capable of providing humans with a peek into the vast expanse of the universe that would otherwise be unavailable. According to Motherboard, the Soviet physicist Gurgen Askarian once theorized, theorized that when a high energy particle interacted with a dense dielectric medium, a type of insulating material that does not conduct electricity, it would produce a shower of secondary charged particles whose radiation can be detected by standard radio antennas. This interaction, now known as the Ascarian effect, allows physicists to detect particles that hardly interact with normal matter like neutrinos by observing the secondary effects. During Anita's time in the Antarctic, it detected never-before-seen upward-pointing cosmic ray-like events. The rays detected had horizontal planes of polarization, which may suggest they did not originate in space. The detection of these events means a new type of particle may have been evaded, evading detection by sophisticated particle accelerators since we began using sophisticated particle accelerators. That thanks to the standard model, Physicists have known that cosmic rays are capable of reaching and penetrating Earth. However, according to the model, those rays should not be able to pass all the way through our planet. So are the anomalous high energy particles measured by NETA originating from Earth, or are they actually passing through Earth? Some existing physics models that exist beyond the standard model involve theories that the interaction between cosmic rays and the ice actually produce micro black holes that open into small dimensions. That's frightening, isn't it? Now, Anita's first mission did not detect the black holes, but it did detect the Ascarian effect. Last week, a group of researchers posted a new theory about the rays measured by Anita. The group, led by Pennsylvania State University physics Derek Fox, suggested Anita may have found evidence of a particle that lies completely outside of the standard model of physics. The standard model has been successful as long as we've been using it, but it has not been able to explain everything. For example, things like gravity and the acceleration expansion of the universe and not adequately explained by the model. And there's where the physics beyond the standard model, BSM, some of those theories include string theory and extra dimensions. Fox's theory relies on a type of BSM called supersymmetry. But we argue that if the Anita events are correctly interpreted, then they require some beyond the standard model particle, end quote. This is what Fox told Motherboard. 
Quote, the likely properties of the particle seem consistent in at least some ways with the predicted properties of the Stau in supermetric models. In order to delve further into the unknown when it comes to these upward pointing cosmic rays, they must also be observed at other locations. Fox and his colleagues took the first steps when analyzing data from the Ice Cube Neutrino Observatory in the Arctic. Despite the difference in detection systems, three events were identified in the data that were analogous to the cosmic rays observed by NITA in Antarctica. Fox's theory is not one interpretation of the NITA data. The fourth NITA mission was launched in 2016, and researchers are hopeful that its data, once completely analyzed, will reveal additional examples of these unusual cosmic rays.